Hi guys, Willem D. Ritter here with Quality First Real Estate. I want to share with you my top four tips to sell your house for the highest possible price. So when it comes time to sell, every seller wants the same thing, to sell quickly and for as much money as possible. So sellers who sell for the highest possible price all share a few things in common. So I want to review those top four things with you. Number one, they get organized and decluttered way before they think about listing. So even if that means you know, renting a storage unit, putting some furniture in there, taking the butterfly collection down, maybe one of the 19 photos that you have on the family room wall. I know that may be painful for some of you, but I promise you'll be rewarded at the end. Number two, they enlist a trusted and experienced agent. So sellers who sell for the highest possible price usually start working with that agent well before they ever get officially listed on the market. You want somebody who has a different perspective on your house than you will. So somebody who looks at it in, in the lens of a buyer and is gonna be hypercritical of the floor plan and all the things you have in there, we wanna make it appealing to as many people as possible. So very important to get a different set of eyes who are gonna look at it a little differently than you are since you've lived there for so long. Successful sellers vet their agent carefully. First impressions matter a lot, but so do the agent's track record and statistics. You should ask them what their average list to sales price is and what their average days on market is before accepting an offer. If an agent doesn't know their statistics, that's a huge red flag um, and you should have a second thought about hiring them. Their marketing, of course, matters, what they're gonna do to market your home and bring in a buyer, but um, not all agents are built the same. There's a reason there's an 87% 80, failure rate in our industry. I know maybe your second cousin just got their real estate license last year, sold one home, but this is your hard-earned equity at risk. By making a wrong hire, you could potentially be losing tens of thousands of dollars. So take them out for a nice steak dinner and maybe down the road they can help you, but again, who you work with matters, so very important to hire the right person for that. Number three, they updated their home. So whether that's doing you know, a bathroom remodel or some floors or painting or a little curb appeal on the exterior, super important. Today's buyer, they don't necessarily have a lot of capital or cash available to do those projects. They want something that's turnkey and move-in ready. So if you can do that ahead of time, it's gonna make a big difference. They're willing to pay that higher price because they can finance that in their loan. And you know, for another $50,000, their payment's only a few hundred dollars more, but they don't necessarily have that cash available. So fix up your home. Um, through my clients, we call this a seller's concierge program. We'll walk the exterior, go through the house, and we'll analyze and vet what projects make the most sense and will have the highest return on investment to make sure that you guys are not leaving any money on the table. So do some things to, to make sure you're absolutely maximizing your sales price. And last number four, they know that online appeal is a new curb appeal. Sellers and their agents who sold for more than list price made imagery and home information across as many internet mediums as possible. Professional photos and videos are a must. Creating a thorough digital and social media campaign is also a necessity. And lastly, staging may be important for the right instances. Today's buyer is gonna see that home online before their agents are gonna show them. So if your home isn't creating an enticing image up front, nobody's gonna to wanna to come see it. And as a result, the net offers you receive will be much lower. So super important to create a good online presence. Um, you only get one shot at a first impression, just like selling your house. So you wanna make it as good as possible. With that said, if you have any thoughts of selling, it's a great time. Prices are peaking. It's a great time to cash out. So if you or anyone you know has any thoughts, please feel free to call or text me anytime. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.